Hello everyone, my name is Spiracle and welcome to Enter the Gungeon. This is a roguelike from Devolver Digital that was released all the way back in 2016, I believe, that I never played for some reason, despite the fact that I absolutely love roguelikes. Now the question is, who do I want to play? The Hunter, the Convict, the Pilot, or the Marine? Now they all seem pretty good, but I'm going to start with the Marine, just because that sounds like a good decision. Plus, I mean, look at the helmet. Just sounds like a smart thing. Normally I'd go for something like the pilot or the hunter, but, you know, who are you? You're a fish man. Well, what do we have here? You must be a new arrival. Let me guess. You had to change the past, right? Well, you're not the first. There's no salvation here. It was like you once came to change the past, and now I have no future. <laughs> I'm gonna break all your bottles, take that. What do you think of that, huh? Well, since you're here, let me help you out. Before you go in, you'll probably want to talk to Manny, who's just through this door here. He'll give you a tour. So off you go, that's why you came, isn't it? So there's a cursed temple. Ha 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 ha. Okay, yeah, sure. Guess I'll go through here. Is this a tutorial? This feels like it's a tutorial. Wayward Soul, approach me and press A to speak. For it is I, Sir Manuel. Yeah, so this is definitely a tutorial. Which means you get to cut ahead. Dodge. Dodge. Can't wait for that to completely fail me when I need it most. Sometimes though, the number of bullets is- Oh, you don't say. Ooh, one of the Gungeon's natural inhabitants. Cruel, savage, and bloodthirsty. Yep. That's one thing I did know about this game, is that the enemies are adorable. Ah, Is this another game that's going to make me feel bad for everything? I feel so. Is that a walking grenade? That's a walking grenade! Okay, note to self, walking grenades exist. Remember that. Um, blank? Yes, blank works. What's this, so? Old Knight Shield? Okay, thank you very much. Well, that was worth it. I don't know what this dead guy is. Is that the same? I think that's the same guy that's teaching me through the tutorial. Well, I feel nice and ready here. This boss doesn't stand a chance, to be honest. Speak with me when you are ready for your final challenge. I think I found your dead body. Are you ready to put all you have learned to the test? Yes. Then, face me in single combat. Oh, you. Okay, now I do get to shoot you. Uh, dodge. Yeah, dodge. You are no match for me. You're almost dead already. Pathetic. Come on, where you at? There you are. Die. Cease fire! Cease fire! You okay? Wait, that shield. You found my shield. I knew it was you, which means you know my terrible secret. It's true, I never conquered the Gungeon. I am no longer sure this even is the Gungeon. Oh, humiliating. It's all the bastard's fault. Whose fault? At Snake Blockner, we were supposed to be partners. But shortly after we arrived, I was shot in the back. When I awoke, I was trapped in some kind of chest. I called out for help, but no one came. I'm sure it was him who shot me. I think he wanted the gun for himself, but he must not have made it. How do you know he didn't make it? Because if Blockner had changed the past, he never would have come to the Gungeon, and neither would I. But I'm still here, so he must have left. Or maybe he's stuck in the Gungeon too. Would serve that bastard right. If you find him, tell him Manny says hi, if you know what I mean. Got it. Anyway, I have nothing left to teach you. Good luck with a gungeon in your past. Well, I feel nice and ready now. Neat little tutorial down the way. I should really check how I reload. Oh, it's X. Probably should have expected that. See, look at how ready I am. I'm dodging everywhere. I wonder if you have something to say. Oh, have you seen that misguided spirit? So manually stuck in those holes. Lost sad, really. <laughs> okay, yeah, whatever. You are now ready to enter. The Gungeon. Yeah, just like the title said, how clever. Down we go. Wow, it has been 22 minutes and I have done nothing. <laughs> and they sealed it behind me. A shrine to an old gunslinger. There is an inscription, kill your past, you've already damned your future. The rest is worn away. Well, that's nice and hopeful. See you are. Oh, you're a big boy. I uh, don't think you're like a bullet at all. You're... Oh, no, you are. You've just been lifting for a couple of decades, non-stop. Haven't really played many roguelikes recently. Most recent was probably Shattered Pixel Dungeon. And that was a whole lot of fun. I love that game. Is that book angry at me? That book is angry at me, and it knows how to spell. Ah! It would really help if they didn't make cute noises whenever I killed them. What's that? An explosive decoy. But I like my walkie-talkie thingy. No, I don't. I don't even have any weapons. Guess I'll use an explosive decoy. Uh, that's the boss room. I do not want to go there yet. Go, shoot my explosive decoy. Do it. Ha. You fool. What are you? What are you? Oh, what are you? Oh, 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 what are you? Wherever you are, you are cute and dead, but also slightly scary. Hello? Ooh. Friend? Oh, no, you're a shop. 
which I guess is kind of a friend. Let me destroy all your barrels for good measure. Oh, a slime thing. Smiley face. Something for the collection? I'll compensate you. What do you mean, something for the collection? What do you want from me? I kind of want that key. I'm taking that key. Lock and lower, right? Yep, but that's not what you do with a key. But seriously, what's this slime thing? Maybe there's something I can give it at some point. But I don't think I can do anything yet. This guy likes to look like a big old threat, but he's really not. It's kind of pathetic, actually. Just pretty easy kill. He tries to hurt me, but he just can't. These guys are more of a threat than him, really. And then no threat. Ooh, extra heart. What's up here? Ooh, now what's this? A table tech site, and my shield is back. That's what I like to see, even though I really shouldn't have lost it earlier, but I did. How did I lose it again? I can't remember. I've already forgotten. I have an incredible memory. Uh, can I open that? I do have a key. No, I think I used the key. Ah, well, I guess there's nothing for me in there. What's this? Thanks for the supply drop, Ratfink. I was going to pick that up. You douche. Well, free we go, I guess. Oh, what's this then? Is that a gat? I think that's a gatling gun. That's a bird that has taken the gatling gun. And now the bird has the gatling gun. Uh, well, you know what? It makes as much sense as the rest of this game, so why not? You're firing missiles from above. You've got a second bird that's done that to me in recent times. You're nothing special. Oh, you think you can hurt me with that, huh? Oh dear, you might hurt me with that. Except for my amazing dodge ability. And not the regular dodge. That's the regular dodge. This is just my standard goodness at the game. Admire the strafing. Oh dear. You think you can hurt me? You're getting mighty close, actually. Oh, ow. I'm gonna use a blank. Take that. Almost dead. Almost dead. And it's dead. Take that Gatlin goal. Do I get your Gatlin? I don't think I'll be able to take it, but... Wait, the birds. The birds. Are they eating the Gatling Gull? They have eaten the Gatling Gull. Oh, the Dungeon Eagle. I was not expecting a Deeg. But I have a Deeg, which makes me happy. And I think that's everything from here, so... Let's make our way forward. Why is there a scary button? What's with the scary button? Hey, you're looking pretty beat up. Want to take a break and come back later? Not this time, chalking button. Good luck down below. Why are you so angry looking? Can I shoot you? Bam. No, no, I cannot. I'm gonna go get that ammo box for that one bullet. Nope, never mind, it's gone. Did the rat take it again? Yeah. If I find that thing, I'm going to shoot it. Let's go down. Chamber two. And what lies in chamber two? Oh, no, there's more of you. Oh, you're exploding grenade bats. Of course you are. Of course you are. Why would anything else exist, really? Exploding grenade bats. Why not? Why not? Oh. Probably shouldn't have walked into the pit. Oh, wow. I uh, should definitely kill the weird shark bullet things before they do that. Oh, and I should kill you before you do that. And I should kill everything, basically. And what's going on? Why is the box so mad at me? Take that box. I wonder what happens if I push a table off the edge. Take that. I unlocked a thingy. Can the Can you go back to the exploding grenade bats, please? These things are worse somehow. I need to get over there, but can I do it with a dodge? Yes, I can. What's in here? It's locked. It's always locked. Oh, what are you? I guess I need a key of some kind to get through you. Maybe I need to kill the boss and then I can free you. Is that the entire... That is the entire level. Well, I guess if we weren't ready for the boss, we have to be now. Oh, it's a it's a bomb. It's, it's just an actual bomb. Oh, and I jumped off the edge like an idiot. Ow. Ow! I am getting destroyed here. I don't want to be because I want to see if I can get those people out of that jail cell. So I need to live. But I only have one more heart and I fell off the edge because I'm a fool. So that went well. I fell in a pit. The most pathetic way to die possible. I guess that means I'm going to play another. Hello. Just quickly, I played another game after because I was having fun. And now we do have a cell key. And we have the same things here, so let's actually see what we can do. Cool, okay, I guess we unlocked a shop. Anyway, enjoy the rest of the video. I could tip those the whole time. How did I get on fire? Why am I on fire? What happened there? And why? I was killed by some fire. I didn't touch any though. Okay, I guess never ever push those things over because apparently you just die. Apparently. 
I also don't know why fire did me for my entire health worth of damage, but whatever, whatever. We go again. It's all part of the experience. I'm just going to murder everything and it will all be better. And I keep shooting shrubbery, but at least I damaged myself, apparently. I have a key though. Oh, what's this? I have a cold reality, whatever that is. Well, it's a gun of some kind. Never would have guessed that. This unique weapon was brought to a gungeon by a disgraced warrior who discarded it when he gave up. The projectiles are fired are extremely low energy, delivering a cold and highly depressing death. Well, isn't that nice? Oh, how lovely. I already feel bad enough for killing these things because they're kind of cute. I can't open this, though, which makes me angry. Who else wants to go then, eh? Who's ready for a highly depressing death? Oh, I walked into you by accident. Well, that wasn't very smart of me now, was it? Who else? Oh, dynamite does. Ow, what are you? Oh dear. Everything, everything go away. You didn't even damage me that, did you? What is that thing? It's smiling at me. Why am I supposed to kill it when it's smiling at me? Well, I suppose that's kind of true for every slime in every game. And I always feel bad when I kill slimes. Why can't I just shoot the lock like you can in everywhere? Is the boss up here? I feel like this way might be the boss. Oh, no, it's not. It's, it's literally smiling at me and I'm supposed to deliver a highly depressing death. Give me a key now. I'm going back to that green chest because it's green and that seems fascinating. Ooh, I got a grenade launcher. Glad I went for the green chest. Uh, it looks so peaceful and deaf. So, so peaceful. Ignore, ignore those. They don't look peaceful and deaf. It, it looks so peaceful. So, so, so peaceful. You do not look peaceful when you're alive, though. Which is why I help you, really. That's what I'm doing. I'm, I'm just helping them in some way. It's a king. I'm going to destroy this king. He doesn't look like he really is bothered about fighting or living, really. Oh, well, you are much more dangerous than I was expecting. Luckily enough. In fact, why am I doing this when I could... That's fire. Take my grenade launcher. Oh, dear king, why? And you're down. Take that, king. Boom. Oh, you're sad. And now you're dead. I, uh... I feel kind of bad. I didn't mean to do that. But at the same time... Uh, I don't know what else the same time is. I do... I just feel bad and I didn't mean to do that. But I'm taking this. I have the helix. What's this? The helix is extremely useful. Hitting two things at once as long as they are certain distances apart. Real science, huh? Well, let's be the judge of this. I consider myself somewhat of a real person. Ooh. Well, that wasn't what I was expecting. But I don't know what I was expecting. I didn't really mean to refill the ammo on that. I thought that refilled the ammo on everything. Gun's partially refilled on everything, it looks. So that's the ammo crate that I actually wanted, I suppose. D what are you doing up there? And more importantly, can you stop? It's the bright side of having a freezy gun, I suppose. This is quite a good gun, actually. I don't know if I should be conserving ammo for anything. But it seems like we get it pretty easily. What are you? Doesn't even matter. I'm not going to give you a chance to do something. There's a shopkeep down there. Which can stay down there for the meantime. What is that thing in the middle? And why is it? Uh, I shot it off into the abyss. Oh dear. Snipers. Snipers. Oh no. Ah. Look at me. I actually used cover. Are you proud of me? I need to jump over there to get that. Yeah, I'm going for it. Yeah, I'm going back. I didn't really think I actually made that jump back, but I'm not going to complain. Dynamite go boom. I didn't realize there was an abyss. Oh, uh, there's an X there, but I don't know if that means I can... Oh, dear. Note self. Grenade launcher bounces back. I don't have a key, but hopefully the shopkeeper will. I Again, abyss. There's an abyss. I keep forgetting the infinite abyss is there. Also, I could have just teleported here. What am I doing in my life? That looks like a pineapple ring. It was an alien sidearm, a laser rifle. I'm taking the key. And I'm teleporting back to this. And I'm opening it. And what is it? A baby good mimic. Oh, I got a pet. I didn't know that was a thing. Except for the puppy that I saw, I suppose. So I guess I kind of did know that was a thing. There is a way for me to drop the gun. I think maybe that's what it wants from me. You know what? I'm not really using the helix. Let's see if it will just take it. Yep, that is how that works. Okay. Well, we learned a thing. I feel kind of bad about doing that. But at the same time, we do need a heart. So I'll have a full heart. 
That was probably worth it just for that because that might save our lives in the boss fight that I presume is here. Nope, that's not the boss fight. Well, ah! uh, is this another... Ch there is another chest up here. Did you just spit at me? Oh, that was a waste of four bullets. What's in here? This is not the boss, but it is a big boy. Here's the boss fight room. And I got a cell key, which is the key to unlock the cell. Never would have guessed that one, would you? <laughs> so I guess we go up here and I stick it directly in its face. Take it. Ha. And I get armor and more armor. And this, which I... I thought I had a key. I did pick up a key, didn't I? Wait, maybe I used the normal key on it and not the cell key? I don't know. I, ju I, d I just don't know. Well, we lost one of our precious armor things that we need. And we're not losing another. Oh, wait, where'd you go? It's a ghost. It's a ghost gun with a gun. To be honest, I'm still kind of annoyed about that. Key. Oh, it's a cell key. Wait, but you're on the other side. How do I? I don't know. I don't fully comprehend what's going on in my life. Through I go. Hello, Onyx. I'm a cop. No, no, it's Onyx. You can't convince me otherwise. It's Onyx. You think you stand a chance? You think you stand a chance, huh? I could even use a grenade launcher if I wanted. This isn't the grenade launcher. You are, uh, you're getting faster. And faster. You know what? Take that. What do you think of that, huh? Oh, apparently you don't like it. It's fine. We've got this boss fight down. I also recognize that this boss fight is literally playing snake and getting faster as it eats things. And I really appreciate that. That's very cool. But it's dead either way. Take that, Onyx. That's what you get. Um, I will have my heart back. Thank you very much. Save for later. And I got a teapot. I appreciate it. I preach. I big preach. Big preach. What is that? Oh, are you? Because I saved the heart for later. I guess so. There's so much that we've left here. There's two chests. Or three chests, maybe. And for some reason, a door that's on the other side. I don't, I don't know. I don't understand. We're going back down. Maybe there's another way back up and then we come across on the other side. I don't know. If there's anything I've learned about anything, it's that I don't understand anything. Oh, my uh, my pet thingy also ignites stuff when I reload. That's cool. Take my hearts. Take my love. There are some pretty cool guns in this, I've got to say. Probably to be expected of a game called Enter the Gungeon that's all styled around this, but still, some pretty cool guns. I do really like this one. And not just because it's big. Ooh. A shrine to a forgotten bullet who laid down his arms. Will you? Um, no. Key, which is what I want. Thank you for the key. Okay, well that's just a mushroom. That's not a... Oh, no, no, never mind. It's a threat. Use a grenade launcher. Where's a grenade launcher? Bam. Take it. I should probably feel bad about how bad I'm playing. Okay, but then I get weird things like that. Is that... A, that's a spider. Okay, cool. Well, uh, get frozen and die. You weird floating spider thing. These enemies are not getting any more normal looking. Ooh. What's this? Magic sweet. Improves health, movement, speed, and damage. Don't mind having that on my side. Definitely not. These guys look like they're from Bubble Bubble. And they're spitting bubbles, so I guess I'm right. You know what? No. Time to shoot things with love. Take it. Take my love. I need to reload. I need to reload my love. I spent too much of it. Now I burnt you alive with it. Wee. I suppose... There is a car. I wonder if I can jump in him from there. Do you reckon? Yes. Yes, I can. Let's go for it. No, I... Okay. Let's go for it. We're ready. Oh. 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 What's happening? Okay, I need to jump in that one from here. We might die trying to do this. Yeah, we're going to die trying to do this. I'm going to stop this. This feels like a very bad idea, even though I reckon there's a cool reward or something up there. But no, definite bad idea. We're, we're almost dead now anyway. We might just die because we tried that so many times. Give me a full heart. I need it. There are two empty slots on the muncher. Why do so many things want my guns? Now I have the minecart. Uh, is this breakable or what? Nope. Okay, well that was a waste. But we can use our key in here. What's this? A charge shot. The charge shot is a weapon from distant lands. Legend said it was once used by mutant gladiators in rocket-propelled death matches across a rocket-propelled death. Uh, that's not what that said. But we all saw what it said, so we don't need to read it again. So, so far, depending on how this thing prepares, it's also on the chopping block. Yeah, it's cool. It's also still on the chopping block. Feels like it would be good for some boss fights, though. I wonder if I can... 
Yes, I can. Uh, are those spike traps? Because they feel like they might be spike traps. And I really can't afford to make a mistake. And now. Okay, they are spike traps. But it's fine because now we're through here. And we gained nothing from that. So I don't really see what the point was. I'm going back here. And I'm going to lay down one of my arms. Trying to a forgotten bullet who laid down his arms. Will you? Yes. Live to gun another day. Oh, did I gain a heart from that? I think I did. Okay, well, cool. That's a thing that can happen. But I do want to see what happens in this one too. So I guess take the charge shot and take the teapot. I guess. The guns are being non-dressed and enjoy your new gun. What's the demon head do? Fires a superheated beam that can ignite enemies. I don't want to fire it in such a small room. Let's see what it does here. Oh, that's what it do. I wonder if I can go back up. Can I go back up? No! I can fall down. What? Where am I? Like, for one, I guess we can't go back up. And for two... Hmm. Well, it's boss fight time. I really do not see us surviving this. Yep, that's Cthulhu. We're dead. Cthulhu awakens, the bell tolls for us, and soon time will not march on, so I guess Metallica lied. Take it. Take my demon head. What are those things? Take it. Take it. Ow. Ow. I should stop firing this thing. I'm actually worse with it. I was being so good. I was doing so good. Until I was not. Ow. Well, we did all right there. We survived for way longer than I thought we were going to. <laughs> but I guess I'll call that here. This was Enter the Gungeon. It's available on Game Pass at the moment. It is great fun, particularly if you love roguelikes like me. And I highly recommend it if you haven't played it already, which it seems most people have. I just am so, so far behind in everything. So thank you everyone so much for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you want to see future content like this. And I hope to see you next time. Cheers.